Finally tonight, it stood for centuries, bringing visitors from around the world with a coin in their hand and a wish in their hearts. And it turns out all those visitors are leaving behind a fortune. Here's NBC's Kelly Cobiea. There's the Colosseum, the Sistine Chapel, and then there's the Trevi Fountain. Marcello, come here. A Roman icon. In so many movies, it's practically a movie star. Three coins in the fountain. With its own box office gold. The reason? Every day, tourists from around the world crowd around to toss a coin. Katie and Megan are from St. Louis. I hear you're supposed to find love if you throw it over your right shoulder. That's only part of it. Throw the first coin and you'll return to Rome. A second coin and you'll find love. And a third, marriage. All those wishes and loose change add up. Today, officials announced that just last year they took in $1.5 million, making the Trevi possibly the most lucrative fountain anywhere. Wow, that's a lot. Every morning they sweep, sorting the coins from everything else. So many pennies that the fountain floweth over. Loose change to you and me, one big donation to the Catholic charity Caritas to help feed the poor. You get a little belief that you'll find love and luck and you give it to a charity as well and you get to like give that luck and love to someone else. A wish and a good deed. That's a penny well spent. Kelly Cobiella, NBC News. That's going to do it for us on this Thursday night. I'm Lester Holt. For all of us at NBC News, thank you for watching and good night. watch and